the blind character, I thought it was a good symbol for, for what I wanted to talk about, which was the discovery of the sexuality of a teenager. And I thought that uh, since he was blind and he had never seen a boy or a girl, and he feel, falls in love with another boy uh, without ever seeing uh, him, yeah. uh, I thought it was a good symbol, a good character to, to portray this, the, how the awakening of our sexuality is, is sometimes, it should be like this, we shouldn't uh, have to see. Yeah. And, okay. and, and working with, uh, with a blind character was, was interesting, we had to uh, always think a little bit about uh, things we needed to change, or how, how he would uh, how he would interact with, with the other actors. But at the end we wanted to make a film that, that had, uh, that he was very, uh, it was very natural for him. He was very alike the other characters. We researched a little bit, but not so much because we wanted to focus on, the, on what's common between him and other teenagers. So we researched for, for example, the way they walk, uh, he has yeah, to hold yeah, the arms, that's what I meant, and yeah. yeah, and the way uh, the actor had to learn how to type in the braille machine, uh, things like that, the specific things, okay. uh, or the way he would move in his house, the way he touches things when he was moving. We did this little research, but it wasn't. Uh, we didn't focus that much on the on on his blindness. It was more on okay and on his the way he he was dealing with life like anybody else. It was it was interesting, and it was since the short I uh, had the short. It was easier to do the feature because I knew things that that would work, uh, things that the character uh, that that worked on the short that would work on the feature. We had the three main characters. It's the same actors from from the short, so we also had their chemistry uh, that we already knew. Uh, so a lot of things were easier because we already had uh, experimented uh, before. So, in a way, it was good to, to have done uh, the first okay. film before. It was very exciting when we, when we won. Uh, it was really good for in Brazil, for example, because the award, uh, a lot of, there was a lot of press because of the award. So when we premiered in Brazil four weeks ago, it was really good. A lot of people talked about the film. Uh, it had a good like work. advertising, I mean. So. Yes, in the, yeah, a lot of newspapers talked about it, the magazines. So and it was such a small film, and in Brazil they're they're not known actors uh, in the film. So mm -hmm. we didn't have a lot to promote the film on. So when we got the award, it was really helpful in that way because it was like, oh, this is the film that won the award. Let's yeah. let's see what's interesting about that. It's, it was it was great. The audiences was uh, was full theater, and everybody was reacting really well. People they got into the movie. They laughed. Some people cried, <laughs> so That's I think, wrong. yeah, I think people were, were emotional about the film. So it was, uh, it was good to see this audience reacting to a film, and like it's, it's different culture. So sometimes you never know if it's going to work a film that's yeah, Brazilian in an audience, yeah, another kind of, uh, culture. Yeah, yeah. so it's really good that it, it worked. You know, we found out that.